Here we're going to look at um, a polyrhythm. Um, uh, we're going to first of all move up to D minor. And we're going to do this. We land it on this chord. And then this is from the first piece in the first video. We can go up to this chord here, which is an A flat. This is just a G flat major triad. And then we can go to here, which is a G major triad over an A. And then we can play the same as we did in C, but all just up a tone in D. And so on. So basically we've got... And of course we can mess around freely in D blues as we did with... So on there. Now we're going to look at this polyrhythm. The polyrhythm, now, um, this is in 4-4. Four, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, and so on. Um, so these, each beat can be divided up into four semicolons. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now these semicolons can be grouped in threes. And we can do this like this. One, by using a, a group of... A, of three notes. So if we got one, two, three, four. There I'm playing semicolons, but the actual grouping is this group of three three notes. So one, two, three, four. One. Notice by the way that if I play on each beat, one, two, three, four. The first beat comes with the A there. The second beat with the D. The third beat with the G, the fourth with the A, and we just sit on that fourth beat there. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. We can just play a single note, single chord in the left hand here, and and do the one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Also do this do this upside down so with the G with the D with the A with the G one two three four one the D with the A G and again just just hold the chord one two three four one two three four one two three four one two three four um, now we can also play these as, as block chords. Um, one, two, three, four. Now this this is quite a challenge. Um, notice it's one together, then it's just before the two. So one, two, halfway between the two and the three. So it's one, two, and the last one comes just after the three, and then you land on the four together. So one before two in the middle between two and three, then after three and with the four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And of course you can just hold the chord down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And we can mix together this. We didn't play these notes. We we could play D, G, and C. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Or and we can just. Back into a D blues. Maybe to do this. Then um, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Thank you.
then we can go down. Then we can go back to the first piece. Then play that several times, then go on to. Same set of ideas here as well. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh, one, two, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two. Fun with that, it's now Friday. I'm going to enjoy the weekend.